Residents in a local apartment complex say the building is overrun with bed bugs. They say the manager has ignored their complaints for months, so they called News 13 for help. Tonight, Kimberly King is back from Brevard, where she saw the bed bugs up close. How bad is it, Kim? Larry, it appears pretty bad. We saw the bugs crawling in numerous spots inside the building. We also spoke with the apartment manager, who told us something now will be done. We saw the bed bugs with our own eyes and captured them on video, crawling on carpets and on the walls. Residents have been collecting them in plastic bags inside Cedar Hill Apartments in Brevard, where about 30 people live. Right here. Oh, yeah, that's one. Yes, yeah, right there. It huh? looks like a bug. It is. Yeah. There it is. It's moving. And jumping. There's one right there. I think it's an infestation is what I would call it. Julie Smith hasn't been bitten. But my son, this 19, he's had a couple on him. Residents say the manager, Jackie Richards, has known about the problem for a year. We feel that she, that our property manager isn't dealing with this properly, uh, that she's trying to avoid it. Tenants finally called News 13 for help. I feel that if this action was not taken, it might have been pushed under the rug like a lot of other things here. We contacted the apartment manager who told us by phone we know there are bed bugs in two apartments. We called our exterminator last Friday. They were here today. We have never had bed bugs before, but we are going to get in and take care of the problem. But, but tenants like Colleen are worried will the complex cover their costs if they have to move out with their pets. Everyone at Cedar Hill is either elderly or disabled. Janice Moore has been sleeping on a recliner chair after finding bugs in her bed. She simply wants them gone. I don't think anyone deserves this. Now you saw some of the live bugs in our video, but my photographer who shot them close up saw even more, saying that when he put the light on, the hallway carpets were teeming with bugs. We will stay on the story to make sure the problem is solved for those residents. Now, if you have something you feel needs investigating, we want to hear from you. Put story tips in the subject line and email us at news at wlos.com.